Hello everyone, in this video let us talk about uh, using Scriptrunner to send an email. In case you are uh, trying to learn uh, Scriptrunner for Jira, I'm sure there will be a point uh, when uh, you may want to send an email uh, using uh, Scriptrunner of course and uh, when it comes to sending an email, there are different uh, scenarios of course you have the option to use the notification schemes in jira but apart from notification schemes maybe you want to um, send an email based on uh, a custom event that may or may not be triggered from the workflow it could be based on a listener and there are so many events in jira that uh, you can uh, listen to or maybe you can use uh, when you are using uh, script runner for Jira and today I wanted to show you this very simple uh, script uh, that you can use in your uh, in your code and you can use it any way you want of course it depends uh, what exactly you want to do but in case you are not satisfied with the built-in notifications and you want to do something uh, a bit more customized then you can uh, use this script for sending an email and this script is of course very simple I'm not really doing any error handling uh, whatsoever but uh, I just wanted to show you how it works so for sending an email of course you need to import uh, you know a few things on top and uh, primarily you need uh, three things you need uh, subject of your uh, email uh, and by the way this subject can be anything I mean right now I'm just using hard-coded values but in reality maybe you want to insert your uh, Jira issue key or maybe you want to insert uh, basically anything that you have in Jira and then you have of course your body then of course you have your uh, email address like uh, where you want to send this email and then when you uh, want to use uh, the emails you can define uh, or basically you can use the outgoing email that is already configured in your uh, Jira instance and uh, sending an email is uh, very simple it is rough it is merely uh, three or four lines of code where you can uh, simply set the first of all you need to declare this uh, email variable and uh, you need to use of course uh, the subject the body and then you are finally sending it so this is a very simple piece of code there is not not really much happening here but uh, this is prob probably a good foundation and of course you can do a lot of other things on top of it you can do some checks you can do some validations you can also make sure that uh, uh, if your mail server is not configured then uh, what else you can do uh, right now i'm not really doing anything if my mail ser server is not configured at all so if you uh, click on the run button and right now i'm using my script console so if you run this uh, it will uh, not really display any message because i'm not really uh, logging anything but uh, I wanted to show you how it looks like when you send an email from Jira and it will simply use your outgoing email address uh, outgoing SMTP server that you have configured and it will uh, uh, use this uh, uh, this prefix so in your Jira you have this prefix that you need to configure and it will take the subject and the body uh, that you have defined in the code so this is all I wanted to share in this uh, video and uh, I hope this piece of code will help you in uh, doing wonderful things with uh, script enough for Jira. So thank you very much for watching this video. Have a nice day. Bye.